What is up guys, Matt the Roof Master here. So today we're checking out the Focusrite Scarlett Solo second generation USB interface. So guys, the Focusrite Scarlett Solo second generation USB interface is an absolutely amazing USB interface. Some of the things that I love about it is, is it's super, super simple to use. Uh, there's nothing complicated, it's just meat and potatoes, simple. And also it is, it is absolutely sturdy as hell. I mean this thing, the casing of it is a nice metal feel, it's solid, it's sturdy, nothing about it feels cheap, nothing about it feels like it could break. So if you take a look up here you can see that there's uh, along the front panel you've got the nice bright LED lights for input 1 and input 2 which gives you, which indicates the signal going through to the interface so it's nice and bright, easy to see. Uh, like I said the layout of it is just, it's just so simple, it's great, it's easy and awesome for home recording. Uh, so you've obviously got you've got your input one, which is for an XLR, so uh, if microphones. Then you've got an instrument uh, input, like a guitar jack input, for running your guitar straight into it or running direct out from an amp. Uh, yeah, guys. And then you've got your volume for your headphones or your monitors, and that's it. Super, super simple. And then on the back, you've got where you connect it to your Mac or PC. Then you've got the inputs for your uh, monitors if you have studio monitors if you're using them you've got them um, indicated here on the back so guys this is a slightly different kind of review for this product I mean it's a great product I use it I love it uh, since I've been using it I've had no problems it's easy to use everything works fine it's awesome it's great but this review is kind of to do with the other side of it a few little extra perks that you get when you purchase uh, Focusrite USB interface. Now this is not only just for this interface, it comes with Focusrite products. So for those of you that didn't know, when you purchase this USB interface or any product from Focusrite, uh, you have to register the product online at the Focusrite website. You have a code which is found on the bottom of the interface. You register your product online, you create an account, you register it, and once it's registered, you get access to a lot of downloads and you get a lot of code sent through loads of updated offers that Focusrite offer you. So now up on the screen as you'll see just a few of those offers that you get when you purchase and register your Focusrite interface. Now one that I think is amazing, as well as all the plugins that you can get, one thing I think is very awesome is that you get a version of Pro Tools, which is just, I thought is, I think is great, because you know, you get your interface, and along with that, you get your recording software, your DAO, your digital audio workstation, you get a download for that. Granted, it's a basic version of Pro Tools, but it's still there, it still gives you what you need, to record. So you purchase this interface, you register it, you hook it up, you download the softwares that they give you from your account for registering and buying the product and you're good to go. You're ready to start recording. It's great just to get you started and I think that's amazing. You don't just get the interface, you get a lot of other perks. I'm constantly getting emails from Focusrite with new offers, new deals, new codes, like new plugins that are being given to download. I think it's absolutely amazing guys that you're not just given an interface, you're given a lot more tools to work with for your recording. So obviously before you uh, attempt to download some of these plugins and all these other kind of things that they offer you, obviously make sure that it's compatible with your computer, whether you've got Mac or PC. A lot of them do run on both Mac and PC, just make sure you select the right one. Uh, but yeah guys, I, I highly recommend the Focusrite. I mean, especially this interface. If you're just starting out home recording, you want something simple, something basic, just to start getting some things down, some ideas. This is 
is perfect. I mean, like I said, I've been using it now for quite a while, a good few months, and I've had no problems with it. It's, it's, it's just great, it's never let me down, it's easy to use, and it's just sturdy, and it's tiny. Like, I thought it was gonna be bigger than this, but it's actually really small, which is good because it just sits, and it's there, it's not in the way, it doesn't take up space. And it looks really smart. Also, it's got these really nice rubber feet on the bottom so it doesn't slide, which is cool. You know, you might have a slippery surface, but with these bad boys, it ain't going nowhere. Now, Focusrite offer a lot of different interfaces. Obviously, you just have to shop around, find what it is you're looking for. For me personally, one microphone input, one uh, instrument cable input for me is perfect. There's just enough right now. Microphone to mic up my cabinet and it's sorted, they do ones with multiple inputs, just shop around, find the one you like. So if you're looking into starting home recording and you're looking for a USB interface, uh, my high, high, high recommendations go towards the Focusrite Scarlett Solo second generation. Uh, go check it out, uh, you won't be disappointed, it is an awesome interface. Focusrite, it helps you focus right. What the hell was that? So thanks for watching everyone, I hope you enjoyed this little video, I just really wanted to get it out there that there's so many cool things that you get with this Focusrite uh, USB interface. I was amazed at all the downloads that you get free just for registering that product, it's absolutely amazing, you get plugins, you get stuff to help mix your, start, your music, all that kind of stuff. Go check it out guys, I highly recommend it. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, and if you're new, hit the subscribe button, come and join the Riffmaster family, we would all love to have you. And as always, rock out, be awesome, and I'll see you soon. See ya!